Welcome back to Ask Dr. Clark. Today's topic, what if both spouses were abusive? This is not uncommon and I'll tell you what to do in this video. Whatever your marital crisis is, I have a biblical, practical, step-by-step -step plan for you. After 35 years, I should have one, and I do. All I have to offer is on my website, davideclarkphd.com. That's Clark with an E. My books, my podcasts, my YouTube videos, my TikTok videos, my phone advice service. And I'm happy to announce the release of my brand new book, Adult Children Who Break Your Heart. Just released first week of January. If you have an adult prodigal, this book is for you. It's available on my website only. We don't need Christian publishers anymore. We publish our books ourselves. Okay, today's question. What happens when we both had abusive tendencies? This is the wife talking, but we both had abusive tendencies. We both participated in the abuse of one another, emotional and physical. We are both getting better separately. Okay, that's good. Here's the kicker though, but one spouse still wants out. Hmm, do I hang on? And what's he wants out? What, what does he want out for? And we'll figure this out. My answer, let's walk through this. So far, you are taking the right steps. When both spouses have been abusive, you don't do marriage counseling, it's too soon for that. You each do individual counseling, all right, to get into solid recovery, spiritually and emotionally, and they're both doing that, which is good. Find out why you were abusive and fix it. Then when each are in solid recovery and your two individual therapists agree, you can start marriage counseling. Best to be physically separated if you can as you do your individual therapy. This starves the dysfunctional marital patterns, ends any possibility of abuse continuing. Uh, you can't continue the abuse cycle and you each can focus on your individual issues. Now in your situation, you have, you have repented for your abusive t behavior and are in recovery. Look, that's all you can do. That's all God asks you to do. If your spouse still wants a divorce, then he's not really doing his work in recovery. I mean, he was abusive too, right? What's the deal? Don't beg or plead or pursue him. Let him go. In fact, get my book, My Spouse Wants Out, and follow my tough love plan. If you're repentant and you're doing the best you can and she still wants out, okay, now we're gonna flip the script on him. When you're ready, emotionally and financially, and you have prepared your kids, you will send your spouse this simple message, not me, not vicious, simply, I'm done with you, all right? We flip the script on him, we turn the tables on him. Now he has to win you back, and we'll see what happens. Your marital sins are no longer the issue. The only issue now is him wanting a divorce. That's what you will attack biblically. Something else, frankly, is going on with your husband. There's something he's not telling you. He's found someone else, or there's deeper resentments. He's not getting his work done. Whatever it might be, it's more about him now than about you. This book, My Spouse Wants Out, will empower you. It will give you strength to get through the divorce and give you the best chance to shake up your spouse and get him to want to win you back. May not work, but it'll be good for you and the kids anyway. Finally, if you find these videos helpful, uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Many of you are doing that, we appreciate it. Uh, tap the like button and leave a rating and a review and a comment. And make sure you check out my I Don't Want a Divorce podcast and my TikTok videos.